Welcome back to Dark Souls, everyone. What a what a time we have for us today. We're picking up right where we left off, right after the uh, good old Sentinel boss fight, right there. Don't worry about all the secret doors that I just walked by. That's fine. That's an exploding man right there. As that sound attests to. So, uh, yeah, let's get on with it. Let's uh, quickly use this bonfire to teleport. Uh, yeah, back to Majula. See you there. Okay, now that we're in Majula, no time to waste. Let's, uh, let's get going to the next guy. We're gonna go see an old friend of ours. You know, a nice, nice good old, uh, callback to the other game. You know, the one. The one that we played before this one. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna go, uh, pay him a visit. Got sword in hand, shield in the other. Glowing green. Just how we like it. And we're gonna head down some spooky corridors, hopefully nothing jumps out at us. Oh. Um yeah, here we're gonna we're gonna get there, we're gonna head to Hyde's Tower of Flame. No one needs that chest, just villains. Now we ring the bell like this, and then we just uh head down here, get ready to walk on through. One of the best weapons is right here on the left. It's that glowing one right there. You can pick it up on your own. Go through. It's one of the strongest weapons in the game. And we're gonna arrive nicely at Hyde's Tower of Flame. Look at that. Look how hot, how t flame that tower is. How you doing, Wakeman? He's probably fine. Now those are the Hyde Knights. They enjoy relaxing. And, um, letting me light fires. And watch as I teleport this large old knight away. So these guys are the old knights. They're from a time long forgotten. And, uh, you know, memes like that. And let's see how, how tough they are. Uh, pretty tough. They drop nice little cracked blue eye orbs, which are, uh, fanciful. Let's get the, the good sword out. You know, just roll around. And, uh, yeah. Just have a nice, fun time with these boys. You know, we don't get to, we don't get to fight them as much as... It's a fight little, you know, not bosses as much. So we're gonna, we're gonna take it nice and easy this time. Nice to, uh, struggle with going up some stairs. Like, we would all look at this boy, holding his shield up. We got him. Now what's this? It seems like some kind of lever. Oh, it was actually an elevator for a lever. Now if we angle the camera just right, you can kind of see the, the axe. Right there. You see it? Right there. Right there, as the thing's pointing up. You see it? Yeah, you see it. Alright, let's keep going. Uh, now we're gonna head over here. Oh, that guy's new. They added a, a boy there. That's different than in the, uh, no, the not new game plus, because remember we beat the game already, which is why we're in new game plus, because we beat the the first one, and if you beat the first one, it obviously has cloud sharing files. So that's how we uh we managed to get over here, where we currently are. Gotcha. <laughs> Alright, we got two boys to deal with. We're gonna use something we haven't used before, the Life Gem. It's a new healing item that they love giving you thousands of in this game. And it just heals you a little slower than a, uh... Than, uh... Than an Estus Flask. But, you know, still good. He's gonna do the rare force attack. This is good, how we have him right now. Then there. And they're uh, both attacking at kind of the same time. Makes it easy for us. Okay, now we can win, since there's just one. Makes it a lot easier. I think slashing is better. For these, to deal with these guys. I don't know. Maybe they don't like this. Maybe they're, they're fine with the stabbing. I don't know, it felt that way. So let's just have another little life gem. 
why not? And we have a, a bountiful amount of Vestas, so... Really... Pretty interchangeable. We get their nice little helmet there. Which is nice. And we get to see another lever that got... Elevated up right here. Ooh, I like my levers on elevators. Just like the next guy. Know what I'm saying? Yeah, you do. So we got that taken care of. Here we see another man with a club. And another man with a... Uh, with, uh, yeah, sitting down. Lots of hide knight. Loads of hide knight. Now this game, headshots do deal more damage. Because, like, I'm dealing, like, 201 by shooting him in the head. And in the body, see? Only 201. Okay, ready, ready, and hi... Yeah! Fantastic. Easy game. You want to fight? Why do you want to fight? Quick. Come over here. You're, you have to be faster than the old knight. Because, you know, multi-target fighting is the funnest thing on the planet. That was dumb. I did the backstab animation, but it didn't give me the, the meme. These guys have long combos. Yep, that was the, the one I wanted. Okay, that guy seems to be back. It's fine. There we go, that's what we wanted. Now they have a respectable amount of health, these old knights. Not the old knights. The old knights are the other ones. The hide knights. Okay, we can have an Estus now. I feel like we've earned it. And, uh, yeah, let's go. Let's get on with it now. Old Knight, I'm ready for you this time. I've grown. There we go. So it looks like we can just get them with the, uh... The nice timing thing going. Now, are you gonna be hostile to me? Yeah, you are. I found the winning strategy. Hey, who are you? <laughs> All right, more stamina, please. There we go. What is this getting there? A little token of fidelity, some black cracked blue eye orbs. That's a dar uh, the d d dargan. Alright, let's beat this Dargan like we've beaten Dargans in the past. Bow in hand, a dick in the other. Alright, now let's uh, let's carefully aim here, because we know it takes more damage in its head. So, alright, just carefully aim. There we go, that's how you kill the dragon. Easy enough, well, let's get on with it. Nine Estes, that's more than a man needs. And we'll just uh, cross this little stone bridge and uh, pull another lever. Get a nice little petrified dragon bones, makes sense. You know, he has some bones. They might be petrified, who knows. No locomotion in those bones anymore, now that he's dead. You just carefully avoid getting smashed by the bridge. But, you know, it's carefully measured, so I don't do that. Then you can head up along... Oh. No, I don't want none of that. That's two boys. That's twice as many as I fought before. This seems quite challenging. Okay, we're gonna do our expert move here. Wow! Way to change direction midair. He has his game genie turned on. Okay, we've successfully tricked them. And the amazing music starts off. For good old or instant. Didn't get the backstab off. Yeah, circle me. Better.
the dreaded three hit combo move. Alright, Dark Orin Steam. Basically at their full power. Your fancy flowing hairpiece will be mine. But that is not his real. That is definitely his thing. Come on, who are you kidding? Who are you kidding? Oh crap. Looks like he's already absorbed Smoth. Okay, let's get more stamina back. Easy enough. Come on, buddy. And boom, Dragon Slayer Ornstein dealt with quite a handily. Yep, uh, we're gonna go light a bonfire right over here. And then, you know, head to the other guy. Because, you know, there's two bosses in this area. Might as well do both, am I right? 173,000 souls. Let's put them all on the line. Let's risk it all to double our money. No, we're not even going to rest, because that'll just cause old knights to spawn again. And we don't want to bother with dealing with those. We have plenty of life lithogems to get us through that. Look at that. Boom. Healthy as can be. There's that guy that was dressed as a red man before. Uh, we still got these red boys to deal with, so um, let's see if we can't like lure one back here to have a have a nice playtime with. Come on, come have a have a go at us. Yep, this is how you uh, play the game. And there he goes. Alright, let's fight the other one normally. More tokens of fidelity. Wow. Spooky boy. Amazing. Very confused he, I think he is. Uh... There we go. Another token of fidelity? Yeah, we get some cracked blue eye orbs on top. Let's just quickly pick up whatever this is. Nice old radiant life gem. That's a little better than the one we have. Ones we have. Uh, let's head down these stairs and head over to the uh, the other guy, the Dragon Rider. So that was the Dragon Slayer. Now we're gonna go visit the Dragon Rider. Now the Dragon Riders didn't actually ride dragons or even drakes. They rode these weird um riders ride in Dark Souls 2. And then you'll get like these funny pictures. They're pretty cool. You know, way more impressive than the actual boss that we're about to fight. Now, I'm not sure if the old knights are hostile right now. Okay, but I don't want to find out. Let's just fight the one. The, I mean, the hide knights. Yeah, I said hide knights, right? Yeah, probably. I don't remember. Just quickly outrun his attacks and just quickly check to see if you're hostile. Hello? No? Alright then. I'll trust you. And we can head down here now. A little summon sign over there for Cheeky uh, Glencore. Just having a look around, checking to see if there's anything wacky going on. No good. Oh! That's exactly what I was worried about. Blue Tear Stone Ring will protect us as we. Run away to secure our health. Okay, this guy has some kind of wacky lance. So, uh, we know exactly how to deal with him. I keep thinking I have better, uh, like my character has better recovery time than he actually has. Let's, let's run away so that we can separate them. Because fighting two enemies is just monumentally harder than fighting just one at the same time. Check out that backstab attack with my Dark Souls too. <laughs> that's how, that's how you can tell. This guy has some wacky armor. There we go. That's the end of that. What did we get? Token of spite. Ooh, spooky boy. All right, let's have another rest just because you know might as well try to use them all. Why not use them all? Now our sword is quite damaged, so we're just gonna uh, pop one of these little bad boys. And now it's back in working condition. 
Jesus Christ. There we go. Much better. That has been dealt with. Okay, now the rest is flask. And now we get to fight a boss. How fun. Alright, Dragon Rider. Let's have a go at you. Basically the same strategy. Uh, rotate, shield, stab. Well, uh, slash. Uh, monumentally easier than Ornstein. Uh, though Ornstein isn't that hard anymore. This one because he doesn't have his, uh, his strongest ability, which is having Smo next to him. Yeah, if you rotate shield side, he can't hit you unless you know you attack at the wrong time. Okay, that doesn't work. <laughs> Just see if you can shield break him. Just checking. He, uh, so if you don't pull the levers, then this place is substantially smaller, and you can trick him into falling. Or, you know, you can just fight him normally. Both are pretty similar in difficulty. And we get the good old Dragon Rider Soul. So let's go get the bonfire that's right up here. And then we can, uh, we can call it a day. A nice goal. Oh, look at that little lady right there. So we'll light this bonfire. You know, Papa Nestis, why not? We could sit and do the same. And we'll see you next time. Like the video if it was good, don't if it wasn't that good. Bye bye!